welcome guys now in this section we will study about inverter different inverter topologies so in this section you can see that this is simple square wave inverter and it is basically converting DC into uh, straight DC into alternating DC form so this is just uh, by mean of switches um, uh, by change the position of switches uh, this waveform square waveform but alternating uh, in shape is produced so this is the output voltage waveform of square wave inverter so this is basically a simplest form of square wave inverter so this is showing you that th in this way they have converted uh, DC into alternating but it is in square shape uh, the disadvantage of this uh, the inverter type is that it carries uh, too much harmonic in it uh, it means that you can see this is the formula for total harmonic disorder so the total harmonic disorder uh, percentage should be uh, as per standard is should be less than 5% whereas uh, if you look on this type of inverter so the percentage is 47.88% which is not really uh, acceptable by any means. So this is uh, har harmonic uh, order or this frequency spectrum is showing the different type of harmonics available in the system. So inverter topologies, so if you want to reduce the harmonic in the in the in the, in the uh, basically waveforms output waveform when it is converted from DC to AC then there are some techniques that are used so some type switching techniques are utilized for the purpose of enhancing the magnitude of the fundamental component and reducing the harmonic to obtain minimize total harmonic disorder so there are some techniques that we will see the harmonic free sinusoidal output is a major area that has been investigated for many years as it is highly desirable in most inverter applications. So the, in, in the start the biggest challenge was to remove harmonics uh, from inverted uh, sub, uh, AC from DC. So with the passage of time some techniques are developed by these techniques uh, harmonics are reduced. So the technique regarding harmonic eliminations are number one is diode clamp multi-level inverter which is in short called as DCMLI technique. Another technique is pulse width modulation PWM technique and we can also combine these two techniques to make a PWM technique in DCMLI. So in these harmonic elimination techniques the lower order harmonics are effectively reduced from output voltage by fundamental switching. So smaller output filters can easily be used to eliminate the remaining higher order harmonics. So uh, they are doing the elimination of lower order harmonics which are very difficult to filter. So higher order harmonics are can easily removed by uh, installing the filters. The topologies are explained in the following sequence. So uh, the topologies we will be explaining like first of all circuit diagram, output voltage, waveform, Fourier analysis, switching angle, calculations, spectrum of output sinusoidal waveform, calculation of total harmonics. Thank you.